It was on this site in the Afro region of Ethiopia that researchers made the landmark discovery. Dubbed MRD, it's a nearly complete skull of an early human ancestor that lived 3.8 million years ago, providing insight into a pivotal period for human evolution. This is really um, a game changer in a lot of ways and answers old questions that we've had lingering around for decades. The fossil belongs to a species known as Australopithecus anamensis, which first appeared roughly 4.2 million years ago. It possessed a mixture of ape-like and human-like characteristics. The species is considered the direct ancestor of Australopithecus afarensis, best known from the partial skeleton nicknamed Lucy, which dates from about 3.2 million years ago. That skeleton was unearthed in 1974, just over 50 kilometers from the site where MRD was unearthed in 2016. MRD now joins Lucy as a key to understanding early human ancestors. Until now, the only skull remains of the Anamensis species were isolated jaw fragments and teeth. The cranium was a crucial missing piece. What it shows is an evolution that was not linear, but more side by side, with the two Australopithecus species coexisting for about 100,000 years. The key point here is that Afarensis overlapped in time with Australopithecus anamensis. That changed the whole mode of evolution. It would be more than three million years before these human ancestors gave rise to Homo sapiens. With this discovery, scientists are one step closer to understanding how we evolved.